The Egyptian government has declared three days of national mourning after 74 people died in a riot at a soccer game. Rival fans clashed with each other in the city of Port Said. Hundreds of supporters ran onto the pitch after the match ended. Many were carrying knives and clubs. Many people died from stab wounds, but more were crushed in a stampede as people tried to leave the stadium in fear of their lives. Egyptians are now questioning where the security forces were at the game and why they could not stop the violence. People are worried by the lack of security that followed last year's revolution. The Egyptian government has declared three days of national mourning after 74 people died in a riot at a soccer game. Rival fans clashed with each other in the city of Port Said. Hundreds of supporters ran onto the pitch after the match ended. Many were carrying knives and clubs. Many people died from stab wounds, but more were crushed in a stampede as people tried to leave the stadium in fear of their lives. Egyptians are now questioning where the security forces were at the game and why they could not stop the violence. People are worried by the lack of security that followed last year's revolution. The Egyptian government has declared three days of national mourning after 74 people died in a riot at a soccer game. Rival fans clashed with each other in the city of Port Said. Hundreds of supporters ran onto the pitch after the match ended. Many were carrying knives and clubs. Many people died from stab wounds, but more were crushed in a stampede as people tried to leave the stadium in fear of their lives. Egyptians are now questioning where the security forces were at the game and why they could not stop the violence. People are worried by the lack of security that followed last year's revolution.